Game Trailers, Game of the Year Awards 2007. Best Graphics. We'll first start by pointing something out. We did not nominate Crisis for this award. We spent well over a week upgrading our rig, and we still had problems running it smoothly. And we just couldn't rationalize placing theoretical performance on this list. With that said, 2007 saw a split in how video games were approached. While Microsoft, with the Xbox 360 and DirectX 10, and Sony, with its number-crunching behemoth, the PlayStation 3, both strolled down the path of more means better. Nintendo walked its own trail, where new gameplay experiences were king. Despite one of the big players bailing out of the arms race, this year easily featured the best-looking games to ever come to market. The following games have to have it all, style and substance. Polygons and shaders are worthless without quality art. And the following nominees exemplified prowess in both areas. Wish me luck. And the nominees are... Assassin's Creed. Visual fidelity and smooth frame rates are one part of a game's visuals, but what ultimately brings digitized characters to life is how they move and interact with their environment. In this regard, Assassin's Creed demonstrated that simulated organic life forms could move with a fluidity and unpredictability that mimicked reality. Toss in living, breathing cities that sprawled out for miles in their entirety, and you had the makings of one of the more visually arresting games of 2007. Bioshock. If art is indeed king, then Bioshock should have been crowned months ago. The game's setting was unique, but without Art Deco splashed all over the environment's rapture, would have been ruptured. The period-specific architecture and decor were more than enough to make the player feel like he was visiting a long-lost civilization, and the game's technical merits, from the plasmids to making water finally look real in a video game, were achievements that earned its well-deserved nomination. Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare When a console life cycle begins, we're always treated to tech demos that make it seem like virtual reality is just a clever programmer away. Inevitably, the end result almost always falls well short of expectations. But Call of Duty 4 made good on many of the next-gen promises with its photorealistic depictions of what modern-day war looks like firsthand. Many developers tried and many failed, but Infinity Ward managed to strike a perfect balance between art and technology, utilizing each machine to the fullest. Ratchet and Clank Future, Tools of Destruction. Toy Story level graphics were supposed to be available on the N64, then on the PlayStation 2, but in the end, both were left out of the room. We finally reached the zenith with Ratchet and Clank Future Tools of Destruction. There's never been a cartoon game that looked as good as this. From its exquisite animation to the ungodly amount of polygons its engine pushed, Tools of Destruction created the bar that other games of its ilk will have to live up to. Uncharted Drake's Fortune. Naughty Dog has always been one of those developers that managed to get the most out of whatever hardware it worked on. Nothing changed with its first PlayStation 3 game, Uncharted Drake's Fortune. Set in a lush jungle environment with tons of foliage all perfectly lit as it reacted to Drake's movements, from purely a technical perspective, it had no peer on the console. The attention to detail is what set it apart, with clothes that actually look wet and an adaptive animation system that made sure Drake reacted to every last nook and cranny of the ruins. And the winner is... Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare Sure, there are portions of each of the nominees that look better than an average moment in Call of Duty 4. But Modern Warfare was the perfect visual storm as it struck a balance between technology and artistic genius. Once we flipped on the night vision goggles for the first time, we were sold as previously invisible laser sights danced across the battlefield and dust swirled in the light. Call of Duty 4 used its graphical prowess for more than just visual splendor, as it was also tied to the fabric of the gameplay. 
and it was one of the few multi-platform games that received just as much attention on one system as it did another, giving it the Best Graphics Award for 2007.